It is 2040 AD. And I am a citizen of the new India. The world that I live in now is a direct consequence of an initiative that started three decades ago. It transformed the future and created a new paradigm of development for India. Where did it begin? What were the ideas behind it? How did it capture the imagination of millions? And how did these cities of the future come to be? This initiative is where it all began. The Delhi-Mumbai Industrial Corridor. It began in India in 2011. In a nation experiencing growth at unprecedented rates. A country towards which the eyes of the world were turning. The opportunity was immense. The potential endless. The challenge was clear. A new vibrant India needed to be created in the next three decades. An India that could sustain growth. Develop the manufacturing sector. Reduce logistics cost. And promote environmentally sustainable urbanization. In the next few decades, more than 350 million Indians would move to India's urban centers. 500 new cities would need to be developed. Urbanization would be the key driver of growth. India would need to create next generation quality infrastructure. This was a global opportunity to set a global example. And it was to capitalize this opportunity that DMICDC was conceived of as a partnership project between India and Japan. Along with the DFC, DMIC is the, one of the core commitments of the Japanese government. And uh, we have made this commitment uh, at the meeting of uh, the Prime Ministers of uh, both uh, Japan and India since uh, 2006. We have held nine meetings already in order to address various issues in this project. We do have uh, advantage in the uh, technology of uh, environment protection and uh, energy conservation. So these are the areas I think uh, Japanese uh, companies will be able to demonstrate uh, in uh, promoting this idea of uh, the smart city and also the uh, entire DMIC project. This project intends to do nothing less than define the future of what it means to create a city to live in that city, to work in that city, and to have that city contribute to its economy. And so it began. A mega infrastructure project of 100 billion US dollars with detailed master planning from the world's best master planners. Passing through six states, riding on the backbone of a dedicated freight corridor of 1,483 kilometers, covering a total area of 600,000 square kilometers, touching the lives of 180 million people, growing around the high traffic dedicated container railway freight corridor, a global manufacturing and industrial hub encompassing 24 investment regions and industrial areas. It's been a fantastic experience to see how much uh, deep thought has been put into the development in India. Citizens of the present, do you see the magnitude of this vision? Do you realize the endless possibilities of using technology to deliver sustainable prosperity for the citizen? As you watch this, there are many integrated manufacturing cities being developed in six states. Uttar Pradesh, Haryana, Rajasthan, Madhya Pradesh, Gujarat and Maharashtra. Your present is brimming with optimism. There are vast opportunities to be tapped. In Japan, we have uh, similar industrial corridors including those uh, Tokyo, Osaka. And that uh, industrial corridor uh, played a very important uh, role for economic growth. Under the next uh, five-year development plan, India, India government is planning to construct uh, one trillion uh, infrastructure, out of uh, which 50% uh, will be carried out by PPP basis. Uh, so that uh, would uh, provide offer huge potential for uh, foreign investors 
including Japanese investors. This is a, a remarkably aggressive and exciting opportunity for India and the states involved in that corridor activity to change the future of the country, to change their own future, and to change the future of the people who live and work here. See this? This is the city I live in, where technologies are harnessed for transportation, water is recycled, smart grids renew energy and reuse waste, housing, green areas, walkability, everything is catered to. I live in a prosperous, sustainable city. And it is all because of what you are doing now. Hold on tightly to this vision. Realize its vast potential. Become a partner to it and make it real for the world and for your own future. We shall meet again in this future in this new India. A future that owes much to a current initiative. The Delhi-Mumbai Industrial Corridor.